Starting off the day on a chilly note, we talked about this all week long. Things are going to get progressively colder each morning. Here we are uh, dealing with the first 30s on the map in some spots, and Rochester has been as cold as 39 this morning, and we've uh, just recently bounced back up to 40 degrees, but looking live outside, from Assisi Heights. That's our Lewiston Auto Camera. We have some passing clouds overhead. Temperatures hovering around 40. We'll make our way into the mid 50s. This will stand most likely as the coldest high temperature since last uh, of the spring, basically since spring, May, we had the 50s. The last time we had the temperature shy of 60 for high temperature anyway. Here's uh, an array of uh, photos from yesterday. A beautiful dose of sunshine, some interesting clouds and spots, interesting foliage, and uh, yeah, some sunshine to go with all those images uh, across the area. And uh, here's the latest on the full uh, uh, foliage outlook. Uh, right now, we're reaching the peak here in the next couple of days in southeast Minnesota, Rochester, and surrounding communities. Next uh, two or three days, we'll be in that peak area, which is typical. This Part of, of the month is right when we normally do that. Up north, m most of the state at or just past the peak. A big part of Wisconsin also reaching the peak at this level. Uh, a couple of sprinkles on future track radar grazing the area to the south. So maybe a sprinkle in North Iowa next two or three hours. Otherwise, just a few passing clouds and increasing sunshine later today. Light breeze right now on the weather patio at the studio. It's 44, feels like 42. The winds five miles per hour. They'll pick up just a little bit this afternoon heading into the 50s, but making it feel just a little cooler than that. But at least we'll have the sunshine most of the day. 40 at the airport, Rochester, waiting for that sun uh, to help try to warm things up. Rather chilly this morning. 39 in Dodge Center, 47 Mason City, and 42 in Rushford. Some passing clouds overhead here in the Med City. 40, the temperature feels like 35 officially. Uh, the winds out of the west, southwest at 7 miles per hour. There are those clouds, but there's clearing coming in for the west. So after this little disturbance south of us moves aside to the east, we're seeing increasing sunshine. In fact, high pressure comes in for the next few days, slowly diminishes those winds. See, that little nagging breeze that's been with us will be with us another day or two, but we'll have less wind overall, uh, progressively speaking, and even more sunshine. Future track, we're looking at the possibility of sprinkles until about 8 30, 9 o'clock before that activity moves on to the east. And again, on the Iowa side of the border, 52 in Des Moines, speaking of Iowa, 40 here in Rochester, but Duluth, seasonally chilly, 39 there, and 43 in Fargo. Uh, here, uh, outlook for the next few days, brisk winds to Today and again tomorrow, but sunny, quiet weather for the next few days. Getting warmer each day. Attack on a couple degrees. In fact, 60s come back as soon as Sunday. Maybe even flirt with 70 by next week. 39 for that morning commute. Uh, chilly though for the time being. Kind of a, a light breeze, some passing clouds. The winds get just a little breezier in the afternoon. 15, maybe gusting as high as 20 miles per hour. High temperature today, 56 degrees. Sunset at 626 this evening. So 50s today, dropping back to the 40s for Friday night football. Uh, temperatures by kickoff in most spots right around 50 degrees or so, or maybe even slightly cooler than that. But at least by then, the winds will be a bit lighter. Future track looking at those clouds for this morning, moving aside to the east. We'll have just a few passing clouds here and there throughout the day. Kind of a cool westerly breeze. Uh, tomorrow, uh, we'll start off with some patches of frost, not widespread frost. The winds are going to be just a little too strong for widespread frost development overnight tonight with a brisk breeze, some sunshine. And then Sunday comes in, high pressure plants itself directly overhead. We'll have a nice little batch of warm air coming in with light winds. And Sunday looks like a terrific day with mid 60s and a lot of sunshine. And then uh, if you're thinking Fools 5, well, that looks like a good one there as well. That's going to happen on Sunday. Uh, race time, 1 o'clock, 62 degrees. Perfect run, uh, running weather uh, for that afternoon. With a light breeze, a lot of sun. 59, the climate average this time of the year. We're going to be at or above that more often than not the next week with some 60s coming in early next week. Even a, a shot at close to 70 degree weather on Monday. Today, partly sunny, breezy and cool. Some passing clouds and then increasing sun later on. West winds 10 to 20 miles per hour. 37 tonight. A little bit of frost late in a couple of spots. Seven day forecast. We have a lot of sunshine for the weekend and still fairly mild weather through most of the next week as well. So overall, a lot of things to be happy and, uh, and smile about because it is <laughs> not just Friday, but it looks like a cheery stretch of sunny weather. And it's great that weather for the Fools 5 is looking good. Yeah. Amazingly pleasant. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you.